Hello everyone, welcome to yet another Arc Mobile video. My name is Rutrin, today we're going to be learning how to hack and build a little air to fish in. Now before we get started, don't forget that if you do enjoy Arc Mobile content, like and subscribe. We are already getting really heckin' close to 10,000 and I decided, you know what, I'll go ahead and open up a PVX server for you guys if we do a 10,000. So anyways, let's go ahead and get into the video. Uh, so we're currently at, uh, let's see what the coordinates, and we're rebuilding a fishing dock over here. The structure can be placed anywhere that fits in a river, and I'm using it to complete any of the daily fishing pursuits that end up in this area. Uh, before I go ahead and build it though, let me go ahead and throw the two ingredients up on <laughs> the two. <laughs> throw the ingredients up on screen. <laughs> I meant to say two like two categories. Uh, basically, the top category is all the required materials if you want to make the bare bone structure, and the second category in the bottom, that's basically any of the decorative items you want to add. So if you want to change decorations, you can, but all, all the last group is just decorations. Now that that's heckin' done though, let's go ahead and get on to the building. Okay, step one. Build stone pillars one foundation apart in a 3x3 square like this, and just high enough to be above the water. Step two. Place the wooden hatch frames on the four corners and fill the remaining pillars with wooden ceilings. If you don't want to use the hatch frames though, those can be substituted with, with the, uh, the ceilings just fine. After that, build 2x3 ceilings just like this hanging off each side. Okay, uh, step four. Build the railings just like this on all four sides along the inner corners of the build. Okay, next, place our remaining stone pillars too high on the outer corners of the original square. These will help support the roof we'll be building later on in the video. This part we're building right now is a small decorative corner that you can add onto two different sides of your build. They can be used for storage, but I mostly decided to keep mine for decorative reasons. Other than the roof, the rest of this video is how I place the decorative items, so I hope everyone enjoys the rest of the video. I'll be talking a little bit less, only saying stuff when I need to explain a part of the build. So anyways, hope you enjoy. Okay, for the next part, I sped up the placing down of the chairs and benches. Uh, there are two standing torches on either, um, heck, on either dock, and uh, two chairs or benches, depending on which side it's on. On my build, I placed the two sets of chairs on the same sides as weapon mounts. Also for this part, make sure you have to build a way to get back onto your platform after you fall off. I kind of forgot to do that earlier, I accidentally forgot to place down the uh, two hatch frames. So definitely make sure you place on the hatch frames and ladders 
or if a staircase you want to set something, just to make sure you're actually able to uh, to leave your dock and still get back up onto it. Here's a cool thing I learned the other day. You can display items on the weapon stands with skins attached. I haven't tested it out with the other skin options, but the smelly fish skin looks hilarious and does make a very, very good uh, talking fish. Okay, you can also test this out with the rocket launchers with the fireworks one. Uh, you should also be able to test it out with the sparkler skin and the candy cane club. All of those should work as well, but, but eh, maybe not so much for this build. Okay, for the roof part, that part confused the heck out of me when I was first building this. But place one wooden wall left and one wooden wall right on each of the four sides with one open spot in the middle. Then after that, uh, build the four wooden walls in the middle opening, and then on top, a giant plus sign with thatch ceilings. Leave one thatch ceiling hanging off the edge of each side, and then place all the thatch slope, ce uh, slope ceilings on the inner corners. And that should do it for the roof.
Last but not least, if you have a character crouched in the attic area you built earlier, you can place beds or more storage boxes there. I just kept just one bed because I'm in a single player safe, but if you're playing on a private server or official or wherever the heck you want to build this, you can place some storage boxes up there. Anyways, that wraps up everything for how to build a fishing dock. Hopefully this can help make it prettier to run the, the daily fishing pursuits. I hope everyone has enjoyed the tutorial, and if you did, subscribing or liking the video always helps. And don't forget, if we can hit 10k, I'll create a new server and stream on that whenever I can. If you have any suggestions on what I should cover next, let me know in the comments down below too. Anyways, thanks for watching everyone, and we'll see you all next time. Bye everyone!